Hi guys, welcome to TechBased. In this video, we're gonna make a top five list of my personal favorite features from Windows 11 Moment 4 update for Windows 11 22H2. And as I've said, this is a personal opinion. So if your opinion is different, please let me know below in the comments, what are your favorite features from this huge update that Microsoft released on the 26th of September, the Moment 4 update for Windows 11 22H2. So those things being said, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the TechBased channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one so let's begin with the video also the features are not in a particular order so don't assume that i talk about them in a certain ranking system no they are pretty randomly selected but these are my top five most favorite features from this update first of all we're going to talk about the new file explorer of course the new file explorer is looking pretty good the new home page the new address bar the new gallery section also the new details pane but for me at least my favorite feature related to the new file explorer is the the ability to tear out or combine tabs to the same window. This is a thing that I was looking forward to the most. It's still not 100% polished. You can still encounter bugs with it, but I'm liking this feature quite a lot. I'm using now Windows 11 Moment for update on my main computer. I think that this is one of the most useful features, at least for me. Next up, we have the never combine taskbar icons. If you right click on the taskbar and then click on taskbar settings, then go to taskbar behaviors, you're going to have these two new options, combine taskbar buttons and high label and this will basically allow you to see all the labels from the taskbar icons if you set it to never. I was using this feature on Windows 10 and I loved it a lot. When I updated to Windows 11, I was very disappointed that this feature was no longer a thing, but now Microsoft finally reintroduced it and of course I'm using it on my main computer and I'm really happy with it. It's pretty well polished, no bugs so far. Another new feature that I like a lot is the new end task on taskbar right click setting. Basically, if you go into the settings app, you can enable this option. If you are updated, of course, to Windows 11 moment for update, go to system, then scroll down a bit, go to for developers, and you're going to have here the option and task, enable and task in taskbar by right click, turn it on. And if you have an app opened, if you right click on it, you're going to have the option to end the task without having to go into task manager and do more clicks. You can basically just right click on the app and task and you are good to go. The task will be ended. Another feature that I like a lot is the new volume mixer. I was using a third party app in Windows 11 as a volume mixer in Windows 11, but now Microsoft finally introduced a volume mixer by default in Windows 11, and you can access it by clicking on the system tray and then clicking on this select a sound output button, and you're going to have the volume mixer here, and when you open apps, of course, you're going to have the option to control volumes for specific apps very easily, and you also have a quick link to more advanced sound settings inside Windows 11 from the settings app. Lastly, one of my favorite features is the native support or more R higher formats. Basically, we no longer need to use third-party software, we can just extract archives with RAR, 7-zip, tar -GZ formats by default in Windows 11. What I'm looking forward to from Microsoft is an implementation of compression with more formats because right now in Windows 11, even though you can extract RAR, 7-zip, tar -GZ archives, you can only compress them to 7-zip and also other options will be welcomed. This is basically my list of top five new features in Windows 11 moment for update. I'm sure most of you will ask, well, why didn't you include Copilot? Well, Copilot Copilot is a good feature, don't get me wrong, but it's still in the preview stage. It's not really making a difference for me in my daily use of Windows 11, and it's not really as surprising so far. Of course, Microsoft will implement more and more features to it and will make it faster and more reliable. And of course, after Microsoft is doing this, we can talk about it then. So as I've said, the question of the day, what are your favorite features from Windows 11 moment for update? Please list them below in the comments. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the TechBase channel with the notification bell active so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. I was Emmanuel from TechBase. Until next time, have a nice day.